please. Good evening, Luis. How are you tonight? Good evening, teacher. I'm fine, I'm fine. Okay, do you have any problems connecting? Yes, I do, teacher. I, I, but in this moment, no, but complete my platform, I have a problem. What, what was the problem? But you completed. I, I can complete the, in the section, the midterm. Uh huh. I don't know what happened. In what part? And um, and use can, could, and and good. Ah, remember that when you use would you mind, and it's negative. Would you mind not sitting? Would you okay. mind not sitting? And the other one is, could you repeat that, please? Ah, uh, okay. Thank you. Okay, so you check it later. Okay, Kenya, good evening tonight. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Thank How you. are you tonight? Uh, I'm fine. I'm re I am ready to learn. Okay, very good. That's the attitude. Okay, I will give one more minute uh, waiting for the other ones to, to connect. Okay. Okay. I don't know what happened. Did you have any problems connecting to the video conference? No. No? I have a okay. problems. Okay, so I don't know why only two of you are here. Okay, but we will start with you, okay? Now let me let me share. Hello, are you there? Yes. Yes. Okay. Let me let me share because uh, there is a problem right here. Okay. So. Okay, so today we will start a new unit, okay? Back to the future. Okay, so we are going to review past, present, and future, okay? Then uh, we have these topics, transportation in the past. We have railroads and ocean liners. And in the present, we have cars and jet airplanes. In the future, we will have flying cars and commercial space flights. Now, in communications, in the past, we have the telephone and the postal system, which is the mail, regular mail. Now we have cell phones and email. And in the future, we're gonna have video phones which we already have in audio letters. In entertainment, we have the radio and movies. In the present, we have television and computer games. And in the future, we will have 3D television and virtual reality games. Questions about this vocabulary, please? Questions about this vocabulary, please. No question. No question. Where, uh, no teacher, question. where is the meaning railroads? Railroads is uh, trains, oh. railroads, right? Los Rieles, okay, railroads, okay? And ocean liners are the boats, big boats, you remember? That was the transportation in the past. More questions? Now, Janet, which of these past 
and present developments are the most important. Railroads and ocean liners, cars and jet airplanes, the telephone and the postal system, cell phones and email, which are the most important for you? In the past was the, the telephone and the post system. Uh-huh, and in the present? Cell phone. The cell phone, okay, very good. Lester, for you, which of these past and present developments are the most important? Uh, today, um, so I guess cars and jet airplanes, and in the past, uh, the telephone and the postal system. Okay, very good. Now, do you think any of the future developments could happen in our lifetime? Let's see, Carlos Marroquín. Do you think any of these future developments will happen in our time? I don't know. You don't know? Well, actually video phones, we already have video phones, right? Okay. Now, what about 3D television and visual reality games? I don't know. Okay, Vladimir Rodriguez, how will clothing and music be different in the future? What is your opinion? Turn on your microphone, Vladimir. About teacher. How will clothing and music be different in the future? Um, it's gonna be different. Um, I don't know, teacher. Um, okay, no problem. Now. Everybody, let's see this conversation. This neighborhood has changed, okay? So listen to this conversation, please, okay? Listen carefully. Conversation. This neighborhood has changed. Part A, listen and practice. neighborhood sure has changed. I know. A few years ago, not many people lived here, but the population is growing so fast these days. Yeah, it seems like there's a construction site on every corner. Remember how we used to buy candy at that little grocery store? Now it's a multiplex cinema. Yeah, and they're tearing down our high school. They're going to build a shopping mall. Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. Fifty years ago, People walked everywhere. Nowadays, they drive. Okay, questions, guys? No. Are you sure? Everybody? Yes, teacher, I'm sure. No question. Okay. Now, repeat after me. This neighborhood sure has changed. This, this neighborhood, neighborhood, sure, neighborhood has changed. Changed. sure has changed. I know a few years ago, not many people lived here, but the population I is know. growing so fast these days. I, I know. know. I know. Years no, ago, not years many ago, people lived here, people but lived the population, population is growing, growing so, so fast. fast these days. Yeah, it seems like there's a construction site on every corner. Yeah, yeah, it it's seems like there's, there's a construction, like construction site on every, corner. every corner. Every corner. Remember how we used to buy candy at that little grocery yeah. store? Now it's a multiplex cinema. Remember, Remember how, how we used, used to buy candy, candy at the little grocery, store? Little grocery store? Now that's it's a multiplex, multiplex cinema. cinema. Yeah, and they are tearing down our high school. They're going yeah. to build a shopping mall. 
Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. Yeah. 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 They, they are tearing down uh, our high school. High school. High school. They are going they're to going to go to a shopping mall. So they will be a used and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. Nowadays, they drive. That's Not because, because everyone, everyone, has, everyone has, has a car. Years ago, years ago people, people walked walk everywhere. 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 Now, now they, 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 they drive. drive. They drive. Question, guys? No questions. Okay, I need you. If you don't have this textbook, please take a picture because I'm going to put you in pairs to practice the conversation. Okay? And remember, when you finish, Switch roles. Okay. Okay. Did you take a picture? Yeah. Yes, everybody? Yes, teacher. Yes, I have it. Tell me. Turn on your microphone. Yes, teacher. Me. Do you yes, did you teacher. take a picture? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. So I'm gonna break you into groups. Let me see how many we have. Ronaldo Osvaldo Quesada Coronado, are you there? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I'm going to make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to make three, three groups, three pairs. Okay, so here we go. Okay, now uh, Carlos Marroquín and, and let's uh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So I'm going to make four pairs. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, come on. Okay. I'm going to make a, a recreate. A, let me see. What can I do? Okay. Go. Kenya. Okay, don't go in, don't go in. I'm going to recreate the groups, please. Thirty seconds, half a minute. Sorry. Okay, no problem. Twenty seconds now. Hold on. Okay. Now, Delmi and Lester go to room number one, Janet and Kenya, room number two, Luis and Ronaldo, room number three, Carlos and Vladimir, room number four, please. Okay, join your rooms, Luis. Uh, in this room moment, number three, okay. Kenya, room number two, Kenya. Delmi and Lester, room number one, please. I was practicing, but tell me and Lester go to room number one, please. How, how Lester, I... go to room number one, please. Okay, how can I enter to the room? Ah, right there. Uh, it... uh, record rooms. Okay, okay. Yeah, it, it will tell you there, you know, that you can go to room number two. Okay. Can you go, Lester? Hello, Lester? Hello, Lester?
Okay, guys, do you have the chance to practice? Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. In 20 seconds, the other one are finished. So let's wait for a few, for a few seconds. Okay. Okie dokie. Okay, very good guys. Okay, excellent. Now, take a look. We are right here uh, and now it says part B. Part B. So he says, listen to the rest of the conversation and what else has changed in the neighborhood? Are you ready? Listen to the rest of the conversation, please. Exercise two, part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What else has changed in their neighborhood? Well, what about that old bookstore? Do you know if it's still there? No, it's not. Now it's a pizzeria. Really? Let's go check it out. All this talk about change is making me hungry. Okay, now, what, it, what, what else has changed? What else has changed? What did you hear? What else did you bookstore. hear that has changed? Huh? Bookstore. The bookstore. Now, bookstore. the bookstore is now what? A uh, pizzeria, maybe. A pizzeria. pizzeria. Listen carefully again. Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What else has changed in their neighborhood? Well, what about that old bookstore? Do you know if it's still there? No, it's not. Now it's a pizzeria. Really? Let's go check it out. All this talk about change is making me hungry. Yeah, so the the bookstore now has become a pizzeria. 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 Okay, very good. Now, this is the grammar focus. Time contrast. Now, in the past we use the simple past and we use used to. Do you remember? Examples. A few years ago, not many people lived here. Now, people used to shop at grocery stores. 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. So we use simple past and used to to talk about past tense statements. Now, what do we use in the present? These days, the population is growing so fast. So we use present progressive or present continuous. Also, today people shop at supermarkets. So we use simple present to talk about the present. Nowadays, people drive their cars instead. So you see, we are using simple, simple present. present. So we can use present continuous and simple present to express what is happening in the present. Now, what about the future? In the future, we use will. And we said that we use will for predictions and to talk about things that have 70 to 90% probability to happen. Soon, there will be a lot of shopping malls prediction. In 20 years, people might buy groceries by computer. Now, might, you use it to express 50 to 70% probability that the events will happen, okay? What is the meaning about me? I'm sorry? What is the meaning about me? Might. Might, might. might means tal vez. Mm -hmm. In okay. 20 years, people might, tal vez, compre groceries by computer. Okay. Now, this we are seeing it now, you know, because you 
you call the supermarket and they bring you the groceries, right? In the future, people are going to use cars even more. Now, you use going to, be going to, to talk about plans and intentions. So that means 90 to 90% 90 that the things are going to happen. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, so different ways to express past statements, different ways to express the present, and different ways to express the future. Okay, now let's practice. Here, match the phrases in column A with the appropriate information from column B. Then compare with a partner. Okay, for example, before the automobile. Most people, oh, no. People didn't travel as much from city to city. Uh -huh. Before the automobile, people the didn't automobile, travel people as didn't much travel from, from city, city, to city to city. Okay, that is correct. Okay, now, what is number two? Before, Before the supermarket, people, people used, used to, to shop, shop at small, at small stores. stores. Very good. People should shop at small stores. Very good. That's it. Okay. Excellent. Now, number three, about 500 years ago. About well, 500 years ago, people played the third game of golf. Uh-huh, that is correct. People played the first game of golf. So about 500 years ago, people played the first game of golf. Now, in most offices today, most people are going to work at home. No, oh, no, no, sorry. People work more than the 40 hours a week. 40 hours a week. Okay, very good. In most offices today, people work more than 40 hours a week. That is correct. Very good. In many cities nowadays, pollution is become a serious problem. Pollution is becoming a serious problem. That is totally correct. In most offices today, pollution is becoming a serious problem. No, the number five in many cities nowadays. Ah, in many cities nowadays, I'm sorry. Soon, what happens soon? Soon, Dr. Meet find a cure for the common cold. Mm, no. Maybe soon. Most people are going to work at home. Okay. Uh huh. Maybe soon. Most people. Well, as a matter of fact, now people are going to work at home. I'm working okay. at home. Is that clear? Hello. Uh -huh. hey, yes. Yes. Uh -huh. In the next hundred years. Doctors might find a cure for the common heart. Yeah, in the next hundred years, doctors might find a cure for the common cold. And what happens with the last one? Sometime in the future. There will probably be cities in space. Sometimes in the future, there will be probably there will probably be cities in the space. Okay, very good. Repeat after me. Before the automobile, people Before didn't the travel as much from city to city. Before the automobile. Before the automobile. People, automobile. people didn't, didn't travel, travel as, as much from city to city. Before there were supermarkets, people used to shop at the small stores. Before there were supermarkets, people used to shop at small stores. About 500 years ago, people played the first game of golf. About 500 years ago, people played the first game of golf. In many cities nowadays, pollution is becoming a serious problem. 
In many, in many cities nowadays, nowadays pollution, pollution is becoming a serious problem. problem. You missed the number four. Ah, in most cities today, people work more than 40 hours a week. In no, most, in most offices today, four. yeah, in most okay. offices today, people most work offices. for more than 40 hours a week. Yes. In most offices in most today, offices people, people work more, more than, than, more than 40, 40 hours, hours, a week. Week. hours a week. 40 hours a week. Soon, there will be, uh, more, nah, 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 let me see. Ah. Eh, ah. Soon, most, people, Soon are most people are going to work at home. Soon, Soon most, most people are going, people to, are going to work at, to work at home. home. In the next hundred years, doctors might find a cure for the common cold. In the next, in the the next, next hundred years, years doctors might find a cure for the common cold. Sometime in the future, there will be probably cities in space. Sometimes in the future, there will be cities in space. Okay, now, very good. Now, pronunciation. The intonation in a statements with time frame. So, take a listen carefully, please. That is CD 14. <laughs> In the past, very few people used computers. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Okay, now, uh, repeat after me. In the past, very few people use computers. In the past, past very few people use computers. computers. Today, people use computers all the time. Yeah. Today, Today, people yeah. use computers all the time. All the time. Okay, in the future, there will be a computer in every home. In, in the, the future, future there, there will be a computer in every home. In every home. Okay, now complete this statement with your own information. Then read your statements to a partner. Pay attention to intonation. Okay, now we're gonna let me show you. As a child, I used to play on the street. I used to play soccer on the street. Five years ago, I took some courses uh, to become uh, an INSA4 uh, facilitator. Nowadays, I teach English virtually. Okay. Uh, next year, I'm going to travel to Europe. In five years, I'll change my car. In 10 years, I might get married. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, now let's see, Luis. No, let's begin with, yeah, Luis. Let me see, wait. Janet, number one. As a child, I used to play with um, many dolls. <laughs> okay, very good. Luis, five years ago. Five years ago, I... I... <laughs> mm. I traveled uh, five I, years ago. I I buy the, my old car. I bought. Remember in the past. I bought. I bought. Okay. My old car. I bought my old car. Okay. Nowadays, Kenya. Nowadays, I work in Santa Paula School. 
Okay, next year, Beatriz. Next year, I'm going to change my work. Ah, okay, very good. Uh, in five years, Ronald. In five years, I... Uh, I'll speak English very well. <laughs> in five years, I... I I, I change the job. I'll change jobs. Okay, very good. Carlos, what happens in 10 years? In 10, in 10 years, I may. No. I might. I might. I, I might. I might all the the or maybe the ninety percent of the shopping is going to be online. Okay, very good. In ten years, ninety percent of the copy might be online. Okay, very good. Uh, who else? Let me see. Lester, as a child, what did you used to do as a child? Uh, as a child, I used to uh, watch cartoons on TV. Okay, very good. Excellent. Five years ago, Vanessa, what did you yeah. do five years ago? Five years ago, I, I bought my motorcycle. Ah, you have a motorcycle. Oh, yes. Very good. <laughs> Nowadays, tell me, what do you do nowadays, tell me? Nowadays, I stay in my house all day. <laughs> okay, very good, <laughs> tell me, uh, that was tell me. Okay, very good. Now, guys, listen for better or for worse. No, before we get to this, I want you to go to the word book, okay? And we are going to do this first exercise. Complete this passage with, with the verbs in the box. Okay, use the past, the present, or the future tense. Using these verbs. For example, in many cities nowadays, food shopping takes very little time. In the past, people used to go to a different shop for each item. Now you buy everything in the same store. Is that clear? Okay. For example, you go to the supermarket and you buy eggs, you buy cereal, you buy meat, you buy uh, towels, you buy toothpaste in the same place. Is that clear? But before... yes. Before, people used to go to different shops to buy different items. Okay, so I want you to complete, I want you to fill in the spaces using these verbs, please. Okay? Using these verbs in the past, in the present, or in the future. Okay, I help you with number two. For example, you buy buy meat in the past. What is the past tense of buy? Boats. For example, Boat. you bought meat Boat. at a butcher shop meat. and fish at a fish market. Very good. Excellent. A fruit market. Okay, and we use this one already. Okay. We use that one already. Okay, what is the next one? A fruit market has fruit and vegetable. Got fruit no. and vegetable. No. Get, get, get. No. Has, sell. No. Sell. 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 
Soul. All fruit and vegetables. All fruit and vegetables. Now, you can say here, for example, you used to buy meat at a butcher shop. And a fruit market used to sell fruit and vegetables. Or simply, you bought and you sold fruit and vegetables. For dried foods, for dried, for dried foods like rice or beans, you, you, have, you, get, to go. you have to go. Uh -huh. You had to go. Have to go. You had to go to grocery stores. Very good. Now, today. Today you. Uh, get. Exactly. Today you get all this thing the thing at, a at the supermarket. Many supermarkets. Have no, have a lot. no, you use a lot of money. No, make, no. make. make. Ah, very good. Many supermarkets make. make a lot of money. This oh. of money. Is that clear? Yes. Now, but times yes. are changing before long. People use. Before long, people, have, have people drive. People, people drive. Oh, drive. drive. Okay, before long, people drive, drive in their cars, drive. cars. In their cars. to hatch superstores to buy everything. To huge, huge means very big. To huge superstores to buy everything. And who knows? Soon, everyone, everyone is at home. Oh, everybody, everyone have, will have, have a computer at home. Uh -huh. Soon, everyone will have a computer at home. And people already, people already use yes. them to purchase everything from and food to furniture. People already use them. To purchase mm -hmm. everything. Oh, people will, people already will use them to purchase everything from food to furniture. Is that clear? Yes. Hello? Yes? Yes, it's, it's yes, clear. Yes. Yeah, very good. Now, complete these sentences. Use the words given and ideas from the picture. These days, so that means in the present, these days, people go to the beach on vacation. In the future, they might go to the moon or to Mars on vacation. Now, let's see. In the past, people so used the past, to. In the past, people, people used to collect records. Collect yes. People used records. to collect records or. People collected records. Collected records. Collected Nowadays, people used to collect. Nowadays, people used to collect. No, no, no. Nowadays, it's in the present. Collect. Now, uh -huh. Nowadays, people, Nowadays collect. people collect CD. Collect people CD. collect CD. Uh -huh. Nowadays, people collect CDs. Now, a few years ago, Ago. Hello, a few years ago. People used to type writers. Today, typewriters. Typewriters. So today, today they use people, people have computers. People, people use, use computers. People use computers. Okay, about a hundred years ago. Uh, women people use women uh, use women women use 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 use
this day women 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 wear short skirts okay very good and the last one nowadays nowadays Mm. Buildings, buildings, tent, uh, have, tent have twenty floors. Twenty floors. Uh, nowadays, buildings have twenty floors. But sometime in the future, buildings, buildings have will have, have right? two hundred floors. I'm sorry, yes, yes, yes. We have two hundred floors. Two hundred floors. Okay, homework. Take a picture. When the people mm -hmm. travel. When the people travel about a hundred years ago. So take a picture and find which is the correct answer. Is that clear? Okay. That is yes. the homework. Okay, now let's go back to the book. Here, listening for better or for worse. So listen to this, please. Page 61. Exercise 8. Perspective. Who wants to make money? Wait, 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 wait. Part it's eight. not this one. Listen to some possible consequences. Of okay, it's not this one. It's this one. Page 60. Exercise 5. Listening. For better or for worse. Part A. Listen to people discuss changes. Now, listen for people discuss changes. So, which topic are they talking about? Population or environment? Transportation or cities? Families or shopping? And what is the change? Okay? If it is population, what was the change? And was the change for better? Or for worse? Worse. Are you ready? Listen. Here we go. Check the topic each person talks about. One. How long have you been living here? Oh, for over 20 years. And have you noticed a lot of changes during that time? Oh, yes. Quite a few. This is a much nicer place to live now than it used to be. It's much greener. When I first moved here, there weren't many trees around. But over the last few years, the city has planted trees everywhere. It's made such a difference. Okay, now, what is the topic? Population or environment? Environment. Environment. Okay, what was the change? Uh, there are more trees. Trees. Uh -huh. They planted trees, right? They planted trees. Or oh, there are more trees. Now, is the change... For better or for worse? Better. Better, correct. So the change was for better. Okay, very good. Now, number two. Here we go. Listen carefully, please. Two. How do you like living here? Well, it's an interesting city, but you really need a car here. Otherwise, you can't go anywhere. There used to be a good bus system but there isn't anymore. Why is that? Well, I think they expect everyone to have a car, so they don't bother to provide decent bus service. It's getting worse and worse. These days, you have to wait for ages for a bus, and when one finally shows up, it's usually full. Okay, what is the topic here? Transportation or cities? Transportation. Transportation, very good. Now, what was the change? What is different now? The people, the people have cars and don't use uh, the bus. Uh -huh. They are not they don't bus, have uh, too many uh -huh. buses, right? Now they don't have too many buses. People use cars. Now is the change for better or for worse? Worse. 
Four words. Four. That is okay. Perfect. Now let's go to the last one. Three. I can't believe how much this neighborhood has changed. What do you mean? Well, when Joe and I first bought this house, that was almost 20 years ago, of course, there were lots of young couples with children living on this street. I don't see any kids out today. That's because they've all grown up and moved out of their parents' houses. Just about the only young children we see around here these days are the grandchildren when they come to visit. It's a shame. I miss the sounds of kids playing. It's gotten way too quiet around here. Okay, what is the topic? Families or shopping? Family. Families. 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 What was the change? Yeah. The, the area has up. many children. Uh -huh. What was the change? The area for um, the children can play is more small, maybe. No. Listen again. Listen again. Well, when Joe and I first bought this house, that was almost 20 years ago, of course, there were lots of young couples with children living on this street. I don't see any kids out today. That's because they've all grown up and moved out of their parents' houses. Just about the only young children we see around here these days are the grandchildren when they come to visit. It's a shame. I miss the sounds of kids playing. It's gotten way too quiet around here. Okay, so what was the change? In the past, um, In the, the past, families have children. They have a family have children, and now the children grow up. And they have grown up and have, have left, right? Okay. Now the yeah. only children is the grandchildren when they come to visit their grandparents. Now the change is for better or for worse? Worse. Mm. For worse. That is okay. Okay, very good, guys. Now, we are going to stop right here. Remember, okay, you need to go to the uh, platform and finish section number one, two, and three, and also the midterm, okay? And section four, now you can do the knowledge check 4.4, and you can do the listening exercise for better or for worse, okay? Okay. So we're gonna go on the daily basis, okay? Remember, this week we are going to do section number three and probably a little bit of section number five, okay? And next week, we're gonna finish section number five and we are going to do the final, okay? Okay. Is that clear? Okay, so start working and get updated, actualizes it in the platform. So we don't have any work behind. Para que no tengamos ninguna retrasos en, en las tareas, okay? Okay. Thank you okay. very much, guys. That's all for tonight. See you Thank tomorrow. You, have a wonderful night. And rest, please, okay? Thanks, okay. See you, you tomorrow. Too. Have a wonderful have a night. Bye-bye. Okay? Bye bye. Have a wonderful night. For you too. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Thank you.